here uh, with you on this early, early morning. That's right. Oh, my light so bright. Anyways, welcome to the channel. Come on in. Grab your coffee. Let's get hot. We're about to do your reading. So, before I get into this, Divine Squad, my little subscribers, thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, and your comments. I absolutely love it. Noobs, that you brand new to the channel. I'm using my Light Seer's Tarot deck. We're going to do your reading. So, Capricorn Aquarius is welcome. Your birthday was January 16th through the 23rd. You're part of the cusp of mystery. That's right. You guys are mysterious, mysterious cuspers, right? <laughs> okay. So, let's get into your reading here. I'm going to skip all the intro and just get hot. You'll figure it out as we go. <laughs> So, uh, crazy weather, huh? Be careful. I went outside and it's all ice storm and I made a little snippet. It's starting. The ice rain. And I made a little snippet video. It's crazy out. So be careful. Okay, if you have to go out, mm, I try not to if you're around my way. Or in your other way because the storm is pretty huge, so, okay. <clears throat> I'm not the weather guy, but, yeah, just be safe. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm going to pull two cards, noobs, just real quick. I, I know I said we were going to get into it, but I'm going to pull two cards. No, I'm not ready yet. <clears throat> Those two cards are your duality, right? So, once I do that. We'll get into your story. Uh, King of Pentacles. So look at you just chilling all by yourself, right? Very abundant, very stable, very grounded. Um, you got a lot going for you. Um, financially, you know, you got a good, you're in a good place, right? So you got your little dog with you and shit, right? You're riding solo. Uh, but you take care of everything you need, so we're not worried about that. Slow down with these cards. They're small, right? So they're just like, Meh. okay. King of King of Pentacles with Queen of Cups, right? Woo! So not only are you very stable in you know your surroundings, your you know your job, your house, you know all that shit's taken care of pretty well. Um, you're also the in this Queen of Cups energy, so you're very like in tune with your emotions right you're very loving and i think you're a little you could be a little sad right you could be a little sad you could be in your emotions look at her in in the water right so it's not like you're drowning but you are in your feelings right and it's probably because you might be alone here okay Let's keep going. Now, that's that's your energy in this present moment, my friends. It's not the past or the future. Okay? So, hit the like button, subscribe, become part of the Divine Family. And here's your first card. Yeah, lovers. See, I know you're sad because you're by yourself. You want you want that connection. You want that, that true love, that divine counterpart, right? <clears throat> I don't blame you. Yeah, see, you want your emperor. Bam! You want your emperor. I mean, two majors right there. <sighs> King and queen. I mean, the duality is just bleeding through this so much. This is good. Okay. So, yes. You want your emperor. You want your divine connection. This is why you're in your feelings. Because you're alone and you want to be in that entanglement. <sighs> but, you know, you're standing your ground, right? You're standing your ground. You're like taking the high road. So you, you're you deciding to be single on purpose because you want a connection with somebody that's on your level, somebody that's in emperor status. Because, I mean, you could be the empress, you know what I mean? And that just means that somebody's, you know, in their higher vibration. They're, you know, connected to both of their sides, their duality, right? King and queen, you know, emperor, empress kind of thing. I think you guys get that. All right, we'll take it. 
So here comes judgment, right? Wow. Judgment card. Okay, yeah, let me get another card after this judgment and I'll tell you what that means. Okay, so here we have judgment and the five of cups. So because you're taking the higher road, you, you're standing your ground, right? Um, with this decision of sticking to only wanting, you know, an emperor type person. So you're, you're holding your morals, you're holding your standards, you know, you're not, um, you're not lowering your vibration cause you freaking know your worth, right? So that's judgment for you that you're not seeing any other way around it. You're not flexing, you're not budging, right? And so the Five of Cups could be that now you're left out in the cold. Or it could change your emotions. It could change the way that you feel because fives represent change. Cups is your emotions, right? Remember, see, in your emotions with the cups in the water. Five of Cups. Five of Cups not really left out in the cold per se as in... Um, how do I explain this? It's not like the Five of Pentacles where you're left out in the cold and, you know, you're strapped for money and all this kind of shit. We're dealing with your emotions. And so you you feel um, left out in the cold in the sense of... Dis, like, dissatisfied. It's like my sulking card. Like, you're sulking. Right, you're in your emotions. You're sulking. You're you're dissatisfied. You're not feeling happy with this kind of right now. This is very emotional. Okay, so the star card. Um, wow, one, two, three, four majors. This is like you know your worth. Okay. So your disappointment and dissatisfaction of being alone and in your feelings because you want a relationship with your emperor. You're standing your ground. You're taking your higher ground, meaning you're not changing your moral values or your character. And that calls judgment to... Um, change some emotions for you because you 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 know you um you go from the queen of cups to the five of cups so you go and you're less in your feelings right you're not so emotional because you know your worth here with the star card you know you're a star you i mean look at you as the king of pentacles come on so it's very emotional right now but it's like you're not budging because you know what you want and you're not going to be disappointed and you're changing the way that you start to see or feel about this because maybe you wavered a few times here with the seven of wands of you know fighting off other people places and things that you know were challenging you to maybe um lower your standards right and you're like hell no this is what I want. This is what I'm worth. This is who I am. Right. Four pentacles. So you're holding on to that. For surely. Holding on to that very tightly. Because this will make you very happy to have this kind of union. Right. No shit. The sun card. Another major. So this is big. This is a big time event in your life. So it's good. You're you're standing your ground, right? You're 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 staying high vibing, right? 
and you're not letting this get discouraged is is it not coming just yet might be on the way it's not quite showing me that yet but you change the way that you were emotional right because you know your worth and you're holding on to that for dear life because this all is what you want to make you happy in life and you're gonna just hold out and be strong right now you have the strength card right so you're holding out you're being strong you're, you're showing a lot of courage i mean you <laughs> who wouldn't be trapped in their mind a little tiny bit right because being single and being like oh i want i want my partner but i don't my partner's not here yet um Maybe they're going through a karmic lesson. Maybe you're going through a karmic lesson. Maybe something like that. I don't know. But that's the being in your head of like, oh my God, um, is this happening or is this not going to happen? But in that process, you're like, I don't want anything less. You will not accept anything less. Right? I'm six. So maybe... The Six of Cups here, maybe it is somebody from your past. This Emperor is somebody from your past that makes you very happy. You're very, 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 very nostalgic about this person. And this is why you're holding on to your values and standards and not going less than because you are the King of Pentacles. And here the Emperor is, you know, your, your counterpart. And it's somebody from the past for sure. So, noobs, this is almost the last card of the story. Hit the like button and subscribe. Become part of the Divine Family. I thank you very much. Here's your last card of the story. Yeah. See, you want to take a leap of faith. You want to take a leap of faith. You just want to do it. You're ready. You're, 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 you're ready to start this journey. Right? You don't care about the risks. You're just like, <laughs> I'm done with swimming in my emotions. I'm ready to be with my emperor, my counterpart, my, you know, other half. Okay, here comes your outcome. First card. Five of Pentacles. What? Okay. Mm. Five of Pentacles with three of Cups. Oh, shit. Well, now, isn't that special? Not really, that's kind of fucked up. <sighs> it's because this person is from your past. Uh, it's saying not take a leap of faith with the fool card here. It's more like don't be a fool because you're going to be left out in the cold because there's a third party involvement. Right. Three of Cups is underneath the Queen of Cups. That's your emotions. This is what you're swimming about. This is what you're worried about. You're worried about if they're, you know, involved with somebody else. Um, and they are. That's why they weren't coming. And you're standing your ground waiting for them, staying high vibing and batting off all the others that were lower vibrations than yourself. And the judgment to be called was that, you know, you're going to stay and hold this energy because this is the kind of person that's going to make you happy. It's somebody that's on your level. And you show strength and courage despite being wrapped up in your freaking head to be a little confused on this past person and wonder if you should be foolish or not because you're going to be left out in the cold because of a third party. Five of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. Yeah. Wow. I another lost for words video like message tarot uh, story. Wow. I thought this was going to happen. It looked like it was going to happen. No wonder you're like in your head. 
about the past person being foolish trying to take that leap of faith because you're just going to be left out in the cold because they're they're involved with somebody in the three of cups they're they got some shit going on so not at this time my friends but it doesn't mean the one that you're choosing is the one that's going to be for you because if they're not ready for you then god will find somebody ready for you so keep that in mind this has been your reading my friends very deep deeper than the marianas trench <laughs> anyways hit the like button subscribe if you enjoyed it leave a comment if you feel like it and uh try not to go out in this crazy weather man it sucks check out my snippet check out my other playlist too i got a bunch of videos out there for y'all so it's gonna be a snow day and i'm just gonna stay in and keep pumping out these messages for y'all so with that being said peace and pray have a great day